Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back with the new Scooby-Doo palette, and I've done a couple of looks. So I'll go through them with you. Um, but to go ahead and get started, I decided to go really glowy today, or glowier than I usually do. So I started off with the Glow Oil by Super Goop as my primer, and this has an SPF of 50 in it. And then I went ahead and added in uh, the e.l.f. Halo Glow. I have mine in Fair One. So uh, actually both of those are probably my primer today. As far as the actual um, foundation I used, uh, this is Relove by Revolution. It's their Super Serum. Uh, this is over at Walmart. It's a brand new line and everything is $5 and under. Um, I have shade F3 is what I'm using there. And then I went ahead and used the Pretty Fresh by ColourPop, and this is um, their, uh, yeah, their Pretty Fresh concealer. And then I used uh, La Cienga, uh, again by ColourPop. It's one of their glowing lips. And uh, with ColourPop, you can get it at Ulta, over at Target, or on the website, on the ColourPop website. And then um, with, uh, let's see, yeah, with the Relove Revolution, that's over at Walmart. So as far as uh, what else I'm wearing, um, for bronzer today, I use the She Glam. And, uh, yeah, I'm using everything from everywhere today. And so this is the lightest shade they have. It's uh, Morning Beam. And so I have that on as my bronzer. She Glam you can get on the Sheen website. And then I did use a natural Glam Light product, uh, the Scooby-Doo. This is the, um, yeah, if you can see that, it's holographic. It's kind of cool there. So I went ahead and used the blush palette. I mixed the blushes from the blush palette. So I went ahead and put this one on the back of my cheek and this one on the front of my cheek. And so, yeah, that's what I went ahead and did for that one. Highlighter, I used ColourPop, and I went ahead and used Seismic. And so this is the Seismic. And... Um, as far as the actual palette, the Scooby-Doo collection is really big at Glamlight, and it has three eyeshadow palettes. They just released a new eyeshadow palette that's actually a larger one. So um, again, with the holographic, and yeah, there you get the whole gang, and there you just get Scooby. So pretty cool packaging. I like it. And... Uh, as far as what I did for look today, each of the rows going across the palette is based on a character. So the top one is going to be Scooby-Doo. And then um, this one down here is going to be Velma. Uh, this one is going to be Fred. And I'm pretty sure this one is Daphne. And actually that leaves one row, doesn't it? Yeah. So um, that was the way I understood the palette. And so that's kind of the way that I've wanted to go ahead and uh, do some of the looks today. So um, over on this side, I went ahead and used the Velma. And um, went ahead and used this one in the crease. Uh, this one right above the crease to go ahead and blend this color. I uh, went ahead and used this one on the inner corner. Then uh, this one on the outer corner, and then down in the, um, for my eyeliner, I went ahead and used this one on, from the inner corner to about halfway, and then I went ahead and used the red from about halfway uh, to the outer corner. So that's what I did there, and this is how the look came out. So they have a lot of pigment. Uh, the the mattes blend really easily, and it's a really pretty palette. Um, I did go ahead and use uh, the Scooby row up here, and um, let's see, I went ahead and started with this as my base color. Then I used uh, this on the inner corner, 
and um, a little bit of this to go ahead and blend this out right under the yeah right under the brow um, let's see what else I used um, oh the shimmer in the outer corner so this one in the outer corner and um, I did have a little bit of the brown on, but it just sort of got taken over by all the other ones. Um, so it really didn't, um, the, yeah, the teals just sort of went right over it. So as far as um, what I did for the eyeliner down here, I used uh, this shimmer from the inner corner over uh, so this is my inner corner highlight and it goes onto the bottom a little bit and then I went ahead and used this color um, about three-fourths of the way to the outer corner so let's see as far as the way that that came out that's the way that that eye look came out and uh, the teals are really pretty this is a gorgeous shade it just um, it has a lot of pigment and it just gives you a lot of um, dimension it has a taupey silver I think it's a duochrome actually Let's see here so yeah that's yeah it's definitely a duochrome so I think it's silver and brown if I'm reading it right it's really really pretty on the eye so that's the way that that one kind of turned out and um, let's see what else did I use uh, the Sky High by Maybelline and the um, let's uh, what's the other one the um, NYX uh, Thicket Stick It and Cool Ash Brown as far as the eyebrows go and so that's how it kind of turned out I did want to go ahead and do a couple of videos just showing the different combinations um, the way that they had set them up and the way that I wanted to play with them and yeah it does leave oh Shaggy this is Shaggy's row why can I okay so we got Scooby's row on the top Shaggy here this one is gonna be Daphne Velma and Fred <laughs> excuse my brain I don't know where it went this was one of my favorite shows when I was growing up and so I mean Saturday morning was always the time to go ahead and watch this kind of thing so um, yeah I don't know where I was there for a moment but uh, back again <laughs> and so that's a look um, these are very very vibrant and they're very colorful and very fun to play with and I definitely recommend um, I have all three of the um, eyeshadow palettes they're all great I would definitely recommend them the blush palette is great too and um, I really hope that they restock some of the things that sold out right away they had this really cute uh, mystery mobile uh, bag makeup bag and some other things the highlighter so glam light if you do watch definitely go ahead and restock because we would all want to add to um, there are definitely things in this collection I would purchase more of like I just said so um, I think that's the video and I hope that you have a great day and I'll see you later bye